robotic surgical system has arrived right here in Central Texas. And we have Dr. Peter Ruff with the Seton Family of Hospitals to tell us all about it and how surgical patients can benefit. Dr. Ruff, good morning. Thank you very morning. much for joining us. Thank tell you. us about this uh, Da Vinci system. Tell me about what, so, what this does. The Da Vinci surgical system, or Da Vinci robot, has been described as actually a surgical system that allows us to perform laparoscopic, minimally, minimally invasive surgeries hmm. um, on patients. Um, specifically, it's a device in which the surgeon sits at the bedside uh, within the operating room, uh, actually looks into a special console with a 3D camera, uh, inserts his hands into some gloves within the console, and wow. then the mechanism actually replicates his motions, scales his motions, filters out any tremors, and allows him to perform the surgery uh, and perform surgeries that would otherwise be very technically difficult. That is amazing. Right. Laparoscopic fashion. You don't want to say like a video game, but it almost is, right? Uh, <laughs> similar to <laughs> it, Surgeons yes. don't say that, yes. right? <laughs> yes, we have to be more formal. Well, about well tell me about uh, what benefit this has for patients. <clears throat> I imagine you said less invasive, right? Right, that, and that's exactly, you know, classic huh. surgeries involved a large incision in a variety of different areas for a variety of different types of surgery. And this allows us to do laparoscopic surgery, which mm -hmm. is essentially we make several small incisions uh, within the body, uh, use cameras to go inside and perform surgeries without the large incision. Has a variety of benefits, uh, decreased bleeding, hmm. obviously decreased recuperative times because uh, the incisions are smaller. Now, now if I'm a patient, I hear a, there's going to be a robot that's mm -hmm. operating on me. I'm going to be right. a little bit, uh, a little bit maybe worried. Well, what do you right. tell your patients? Um, First of all, it's not actually a robot. Okay. That's, that's a little bit of a misnomer. Yeah, sure. So it, it's not thinking on its own at all. It's, it's you. It's entirely but, replicating yeah, sure. my motions. Yeah. Uh, it's been around now, the DaVinci robot's been around for about 10 years or so, mm -hmm. um, performed tens of thousands of surgeries across the world, and really has been absolutely impeccable in its hmm. ability to replicate motions. And quite frankly, the advantages, the technical advantages of the surgery, the delicacy of the dissection, the uh, ability to perform maneuvers that, quite frankly, are almost yeah. impossible with straight laparoscopic instruments. What, what kind of patients are we talking about here? What kind of surgeries? So, so the types of surgeries that I do, uh -huh. um, a lot of surgeries for prostate cancer, okay. um, also do some surgeries for kidney cancer, bladder cancer, yeah. and then some other reconstructive things if there's some other anatomic abnormalities. Yeah. That's within urology. Uh, in addition, uh, uh, there's several other surgical subspecialties that are really doing a lot of robotic surgery these days, gynecology, general surgery, sure. even cardiothoracic surgery is beginning to do sounds, some procedures. Sounds like some amazing technology. It's fantastic. All right, Dr. Peter Ruff from Seton Family of Hospitals, thank you very much for joining us. And, uh, yes, best sir. Of, thank best you. of luck to you on your work. Thanks. All right. And now Mary has a preview of today's uh, forecast. Hi, Mary. Hi.